Hello everyone, today I will show you how you can install um, Visual Boy Advance uh, an emulator on your computer. So yeah, this, 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 uh, just basically this computer thing. So, all you're going to do here is you're going to go into your Google Chrome. You're going to go take your hub. You're going to go into Visual Boy Fans right here. Remember where I added all those files. And then you go click on code and then you click on download zip. And what I will do is I will download the emulator itself. So yep, you can just extract all these files. And yes guys, I did include games in there as well. See I got Legend of Zelda included. So if you want to play that, not only that, but that's where I got some sound from, from my old out outro, and some of my videos. So if you want to play that, you're welcome to. You can even make guides on it, you can make gaming videos, you can do anything you want. It's kept forever, and it's always a draft, so you can do anything you want in here. So all you do is you just click. You double click this application. You will do a full screen, you just click that. And you will open up the Legend of Zelda. I think you do it in two ways. Like, the SAV file, I may need that just in case. So, yes, you will select that. Once that's in here, you open that. And. What that will do is, it will load up the game. And you can see here that the Legend of Zelda is loading. So this is just basically how it loads. And even the store, you can just, you just click enter. And you can see a link thing included. Yes, I did add this. If you want to waste it, that's fine by me. You can just. And yes, you can also start the game up as well. You can click either enter or the A button. That's what you can do. <coughs> Any much anything you want here. And if you want to, you can pretty much get all the sound from the game. You can you can get the game yourself. And the sound. And about the Blender thing, if you want to install that, that's clean in Python. You can tell a little bit of Python. <coughs> Sorry about that. And then, if you want to download that again, you just click download zip. I'm just basically showing you how you can install some programs without adding rights. Like for example, if you want to download Minecraft over here, you just head into Microsoft Store. Slowly at a moment, you can see. It's loading. And then there's Minecraft over here, unless if it's not on this list, so not somewhere, you can click on Show All and just see it. So yeah, that's just pretty much all. And 
And if you want to download the other games for your computer, you can just go to You can go to this link over here and this is and this is just basically the warm home which is meant for school computers only and I carry also for personal computers as well so this is the best warm website for school computers I would recommend this website if I were you so yeah you want to download Game Boy, you just type right here slash wands slash GBC and what I'll do is it'll load up the games over here like Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening, Super Mario Bros, Legend of Zelda All Go Seasons, All Go Ages, DX. If you play a Zelda, it's just actually, let's see here, we have one, two, three. You got four Zeldas over here to choose from. So we have the original Game Boy, and you have the Game Boy Color. But I'm, but, uh, but I'm only including one game that I use within my videos. That's the only game I'm including in the wall in the emulator. For the rest, you can just download in a retrostick.com slash warm slash GBC. So yeah. You can just wait for it to load over here. And yesterday I'll be always show be showing you how you can start two programs. And you can try them out if you want to. It's up to it's up to you. I mean I'm just doing this for going me or travel or travel for weight purposes. And thank you to myself. Yeah, thank you to myself. But sometimes making a grounded video can be laggy. Uh, yes, I still have support on it. It can be funny videos. So, yeah. We're basically talking. Just wait for it. It's ninety one percent complete. Just you can just wait for it to be to be completed. Yep, just basically wait for it. And while I'm there, these are all the files. What I actually want to open is Blender. You want to click over here, and what I'll do is it will load up the application. First, we'll load up a command prompt, and then it will load up this window over here, and then it's going to bring up this little tutorial thingy. Whatsoever, I don't know what this is, but maybe this must be an introduction or something. Yeah, I am just not sure.
Yep, and you can create your animations where you want. You can move this cube around. You can do anything you want with a software. So if you can just move it around a bit if you want to, you can. You can also you can do all sorts of things with it. But for but bad news is you cannot make. But, but bad news is I do not think that you can make. Oh, and, and single grounded video on this thing. Only on Go Animate. You can. Because that's like a drag and drop feature. And. You know what I, you know what I mean. As some of you. You know what I mean. So. Yeah. Just. Basically. Doing all that stuff. So yeah. This is me signing off.